Special Agent 007 is the latest target of a Sony cyber attack. The company announced hackers stole a version of the James Bond movie script, Spectre. TV 1055's Wendy Gillette has the details. The title of the latest James Bond film, Spectre, was announced just this month at a red carpet event in London. We've spent two years getting this together, and there's been so much hard work and effort. Sony officials say an early version of the Spectre screenplay is one of the thousands of documents hackers stole in the latest massive cyber attack against an American company. This is not a problem related to any particular company. This is a global problem. This is just the latest problem for Sony after hackers invaded computers at its entertainment arm November 24th, then leaked sensitive and embarrassing information, including executives disparaging personal emails about Sony actors and others, including President Obama. Sony's in big trouble. Uh, to me, this is Hollywood's Edward Snowden moment. What, and what's a problem with that is we don't know what's coming next. The production company, Eon Productions, is worried anyone who has the screenplay may try to publish it. Eon warns the script is protected by copyright laws and says it will take all necessary steps to keep it under wraps. Skyfall. Done. The James Bond franchise is one of Sony's most lucrative. The most recent movie, Skyfall, raked in the most of any Bond film ever, $1.1 billion worldwide. Sony says production continues on Spectre and other films despite the leak. The movie is set for release November 6, 2015. Wendy Gillette, TV 1055. Now there is speculation that North Korea is behind the cyber attack in retaliation for the upcoming comedy, The Interview. The movie depicts an assassination attempt on North Korean leader Kim Jong-un. North Korea has denied any involvement but said it praises the hacking.